today we will see some misconceptions and common mistakes related to representation of fractions on the number line misconception 1 represent the fraction of the shaded part on the number line most of the times fraction of shaded part is identified incorrectly as the three parts in the given figure are shaded the numerator is 3 and the remaining six parts is taken as the denominator and the fraction is represented as 3 by 6 to represent this on the number line a unit distance is divided into six parts and out of these three parts are taken to express the fraction this is a misconception the correct answer to this question is option 2 because here the shaded part are 3 out of 9 so the fraction will be expressed as 3 by 9 to represent this on a number line unit distance is divided into 9 parts out of which 3 parts are taken to mark the fraction 3 by 9 correctly sometimes fraction is identified correctly and unit distance is also divided into 9 equal parts but to represent 3 out of 9 parts counting is done from 0 to 3 and fraction 3 by 9 is represented on third point from 0 this is a misconception counting of parts must start from the point next to 0 misconception 2 on the given number line which number represents the position of the question mark to find the number that represents the question mark one is subtracted from the numerator and denominator of the next number 7 by 8 by doing so we get the answer 6 by 7 which is an incorrect answer The correct understanding is that here the unit distance is divided into 8 equal parts. Out of these 8 parts, the question mark represents the 6th part. So the correct fraction at this position is 6 by 8. Now we will see some common mistakes related to representation of fractions on the number line. Many times it is observed that while making divisions on the number line it is not divided in equal parts this can result in difficulty in expressing the fractions on the number line to express any fraction on the number line in a correct way all the parts must be divided equally many times parts are counted incorrectly on the number line look at this example it is understood that it is divided into 5 parts by counting from 0 to 1 the correct understanding is that to find the number of parts skip the point at 0 and start counting from the point next to 0 and count up to 1 with this understanding there are four parts here as a result of counting from 0 many times there is also a mistake in expressing fractions suppose if it is asked to represent 5 by 6 on the number line then a number line is made on which six points are marked and considering 0 as the first point the fifth point is marked as 5 by 6 the correct understanding is that we must take seven points on the number line so that the total number of parts will be six today we have seen misconceptions and common mistakes related to the representation of fractions on the number line